um, just got my Skywatcher 8 inch up Sony telescope in the mail today. Um, so we're just going to quick unboxing, see what's in here, and after I get it together, we'll show you guys what's up. So it came in two boxes. This is the big box, it's the optical tube. I'm guessing, well, I don't know. But, um, Packed up good. You can shift it so you never know. And there's actually a box inside of a box. Just going to ask for some help here. Here's the other box. This is the up way. First, um, there's a box within the box here. First, we're going to take a look and we'll see what's inside. <coughs> I'm guessing those are the uh, two included eyepiece. Ah! They are 10 millimeter and 25 millimeter. Finder scope in there. Two inch eye piece adapter. And now I'm gonna push. I'm gonna pop in that later. Now let's do the tube itself. This tube is made of aluminum. It's certainly heavier than the front. Because um, that's where the mirror is. So here we get the uh, solid cap on here. Open it up and take a peek. That's pristine. There's a thick piece of glass to sit in there. Then we have the focuser here. Here's the focuser, so it comes with a cap and the, the two inch eye piece that's all locked in there. So yeah, looks to be in pretty good shape. Set that to the side for now. And we have the other box. First thing we see in the box is the instruction manual. I took a look at it on, online. It's uh, pretty detailed. Shows all what you should get in the box, the contents, how to assemble the base. Um, goes on to how to properly collimate, align the mirror, um, observing site. All the uh, calculations here for field of view and focal length and zoom and all that stuff. What's that? What's that? So, one board of the base. It's uh, pretty thick and it's got a nice finish on it actually. I'm surprised. Definitely won't get all dewy, or I mean, like, do will get on it, but it won't you know, eat into it or anything like that. So there's one part of it. Another part of it right here. This one wants to have a few, uh, Um, that's our 
eyepiece rack for the scope. That's one reason why I bought this scope. Always nice to have an eyepiece rack. Um, and move some stuff inside. Handle. Uh, tension control knob and basically a So we got wrench, wrenches, screwdrivers. That's good. They included those. I have all that stuff around the house, so it's not a big deal. Some people. Some people. And another piece of the mail. Again, with that same uh, feeling of quality. Once I get it all assembled, I'll show you guys what it looks like, how it went, give you my thoughts on it, um, and I'll take it out and do a video about that. Should be a good time. Anyway, see y'all later.